Hey, everybody. Welcome to JSA TV and JSA Podcast, the newsroom for telecom and data center professionals. I'm Jamie Scott Okataya, and joining me today, we're so honored to have Richard Coyle, President and CEO of Extinet Systems. Rich, welcome to JSA TV. Hi, thanks. Thanks, Jamie. I appreciate the opportunity to talk to you. Uh, we're so excited to talk to you, and what a perfect time to do so, uh, Extinet, as we're rolling into football season, a little teaser there for our viewers. Uh, but look, first things first, let's set the table here. Uh, if you can tell our viewers who may not already be familiar, of course, with the company of Extinet, tell us a little bit about yourselves. Sure. Thank you. Extinet is the uh, nation's largest privately held uh, provider of digital communications infrastructure. We service the uh, mobile network operators, real estate owners, enterprise customers, and rural internet providers. Today, we operate in urban, suburban, and rural markets, connecting customers to applications and services, both outdoor and in, in, indoor, with uh, that being hundreds of sports and entertainment venues, hotels, convention centers, college campuses, and uh, transit systems. Oh my goodness. And uh, of course, uh, you uh, operate in many states. Uh, let's zero in on why everything is bigger in Texas. And for Extranet, tell us about your upcoming relocation head of your company headquarters and why it's important to bring Extranet into that Lone Star State. Yeah, it, it was uh, we when we decided to start taking a look at where we wanted our headquarters, you know, we took a look around the country and uh, ultimately settled on uh, Frisco, Texas. We're gonna be building a uh, 30, 37,000 square foot headquarters. Wow. It's gonna be home to about 150 of our employees. And more importantly, it's, it's gonna bring us closer to some of our largest clients and carrier partners. The employee base is closer to the company's lar largest percentage also of our owned and managed networks. You know, the office building is in Frisco Station which is, uh, as you may know, a globally recognized award-winning 242-acre mixed-use development in one of the fastest growing communities in the U.S. It's also known as the Star District, which is home to the Dallas Cowboys training facility and has a vast uh, you know, mixed use of restaurants, shopping, and entertainment. So we're very excited and uh, can't wait to get down there. And Frisco, Texas is very Excited to have you. I've uh, I've heard some great praise by the governor of Texas, Mr. Greg Abbott, as well as the mayor of Frisco, Jeff Cheney, and even the city's economic development council. All excited uh, to have Extinet uh, in, in their hometown. Can you tell us more about the benefits of joining, as you mentioned, one of the country's top destinations for technology and innovation? Yeah. First off, I really like to thank. Uh, the governor, Greg Abbott, and the mayor, uh, Jeff Cheney, for their hospitality and, uh, uh, you know, through this process. And more importantly is the uh, Frisco Economic Development Council. They really helped drive the decision and made it that much easier for us. You know, Texas has led the nation in high-tech exports in 2021. By the way, that's the ninth consecutive year where they've exported a little over $50 billion worth of technology. You know, Frisco is part of the Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex, which has a high concentrations of company headquarters with experience and more importantly, diverse talent. You know, for us, major innovation tech leaders and investors are focusing on Frisco as a tech hub, and that helped drive a lot of our decision. You know, just as important, today there are eight professional collegiate sports organizations with four pro stadiums in the area. For us, Frisco is a model for public and private partnership. You know, when we look at what it does for Extinet personally, you know, we wanted to bring the, the back the feeling of community and foster a greater sense of belonging for our team. The opportunity to reimagine our future and having a shift towards more of a collaborative and transformative culture. So, you know, we are, try, we, we are looking to strive and succeed together. You know, and Frisco offers, in my opinion, the work-life balance and puts us near many of our closest partners and clients. Yeah, oh, absolutely. A, a, a great decision, uh, well-researched, uh, and uh, and work-life balance. Can't talk about that enough these days, uh, post-pandemic particularly. And let's get back to an earlier hint that we threw out there about the start of the football season. Excellent. Now, 
synonymous with some of the biggest sports teams and venues, even across the country in Texas alone. Uh, well, you mentioned the Cowboys, but you also have the Spurs, Formula One racing, nothing yep. like heading right into the heart of Texas right there. Tell us about some of these projects. Yeah, you know, as large venues compete with streaming services to get fans back in the seats, they're turning to us and others like us to up and amp up that uh, customer experience. You know, you mentioned a couple, but at AT AT&T Center in San Antonio, the home of the Spurs, we just recently lit a private wireless network. You know, we were chosen in an exclusive partnership with the Spurs Sports and Entertainment Group to deliver a high performing wireless solution to create that un- unforgettable fan experience and have them keep coming back for more. You know, in Austin, you talk about Formula One, well, the Circuit of the Americas, we just upgraded all of the existing fiber infrastructure to support the latest network technologies and increasing coverage and capacity at their 1,500 acre uh, site to help deliver, again, CODA's goal of the best holistic fan experience in sports and entertainment. And then finally, In Frisco itself, in the Frisco Star, we landed the rights at the Ford Center, the home of the Dallas Cowboys training facility, as well as the retail and entertainment venue. The site has already been chosen to host next year's Academy of Country Music Awards. So we're going to get there just in time. And so we're we're excited to be part of the community, not only just being part, but servicing uh, these companies as, as they look to enhance that customer experience. Oh, so exciting. Not just for us here in the infrastructure space, but so exciting for all fans out there, uh, whether in sports arenas or um, even watching the Academy of Country Music Awards. I love it. Um, So, okay, for those who want to know more and tell us a little bit about what's on the horizon for Extinet. Sure, well, there's a lot of exciting things. And, you know, we've talked about the sports aspect of the customer experience. We were recently chosen to design and build and operate and own an access network for all of MGM resorts across the U.S. It's the largest in-building project in the country, and it is an example of our commitment to helping this segment grow. And we're excited to work with MGM and the wireless carriers in delivering a great customer experience. And and that's going to drive, I believe, again, if the focus is on the customer's we love being right in the middle of that and connecting both the venue and the wireless carriers. You know, we feel like we are strategically leading in this segment as we continue to perform at the highest levels for both the venue owners and the wireless carriers. You know, we recognize once people started coming back to work and play in stadiums and entertainment centers, it became clear the industry had fallen behind. Mm-hmm. So we were seeing a renewed enthusiasm for indoor especially around the fan and the guest experience. You know, the indoor direction has shifted from solely being an MNO funded solution to more of a sharing of the wealth between the MNOs, the venue owners and operators like us. You know, the model is changing and we're we're working to help drive that change. So it's it's an exciting time. So, you know, talking about what's on the horizon, I think there's gonna be a lot where we help drive that customer experience and we're excited to be part of it oh such an exciting time as you said uh so rich where can our viewers go to learn more sure you can go to uh, www.extinetsystems with an s.com and uh, feel free to reach out to us and uh, we'd love to talk to you more about it oh thank you so much rich for your time here and viewers you heard it here extinet systems with an s.com Thank you so much for viewers for taking the time to uh, to chat with us and hear our, our discussion with Rich today. Uh, thank you for tuning in as always to JSA TV and JSA Podcasts. As always, happy networking. Mm-hmm.